Hi, I'm Beth from H&H &H Bespoke. Um, thank you for the event, it's been a great evening. There are some questions that people have had from the event in the evening and we'd like to share our thoughts and opinion of them. So, Section 21 and Section 8 currently exist. However, in the next 6 to 12 months, Section 21 will be abolished. And Section 1 was, or, or will be, um, what was the way to get rid of your tenant effectively. So after a period, after the two months that they're not paying their rent or vacating the property when you've served notice, um, the Section 21 come into act. So sort of park that one now because it's sort of old news. The Section 8 gives us more reasons to get rid of a tenant. Now this could be um, that you're looking to sell your house, that you want vacant possession, that you've got another reason other than for that tenant to stay there. And the Section 8 is what allows you to get possession back of your property through different methods. It's not perfect and it will be harder with the white paper coming out still to get rid of a tenant and that's why landlord's insurance is important. There are lots of reasons more to get vacant possession of your property should you need to and that's where Section 8 comes into it. How do you profile a tenant is so difficult, but what we do is our due diligence. So the referencing process actually shows us uh, their banking, their due diligence in terms of their uh, employment, what their background looks like in that, and through open banking we can verify all those details. The other way that we have our due diligence is the meeting process, so physically meeting that tenant. We don't take any pre-offers before a tenant moves in, so we physically must meet them in person, understand them and quiz them on what their intentions are and how that they can look after the property and their experience of looking after the property uh, because that all makes a good tenant. In terms of insuring the rent, yeah absolutely you can do that. Um, you can take a, a rental insurance out that costs approximately around £30 a month if your rent is under £2,500 a month. If it's over £2,500 a month then we have to do a bespoke package. Um, but that pays out after day 21 should your tenant not pay their rent. So therefore, and until the point that it becomes vacant possession. So you have all bases covered um, and the quickest speed to your income uh, stream being continuous.